Leaf, 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 the power. Live, live, live the power. Somebody else going to this house. Oh, frick, no. Is there anywhere else to go? Of course there isn't. Of course there isn't. Da, da, da. Please don't go to this house. Probably going to this house. There's nowhere else to go. Well, it's true, actually. There is nowhere else to go that people won't go to. Except for the big stuff over here. Like, what? Ooh, I'm landing perfectly at a house. Perfectly at a house. Perfectly at a house. Go, 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 Power Rangers. 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 Want me break it up for you? Go, go, Power Rangers. Go, go, Power Wall. Yes, bro. One sec, I'll hold. Like this. Stop it or I'm going to take it away. Take it away. We don't cry. No okay, need of it. so Eat drop up. and drop. Is that a scope? Oh, this has a red dot. I'd rather have this than anything. Did I just see a dude? Did I just... Oh, don't choke. <coughs> Zachary, stop choking. Oh, to get wrecked. Get wrecked. Oh, did he? Yeah, I can hardly hear her. I had to go down the hallway. Anyway, she asked, she said about, they do have some complimentary TVs in the hospital. Supply. I said, well, he's in a private Body room. Or... Doesn't he get TV? I said, he's had it all this week. I said, I didn't pay for it, only one day. Which was Monday, I think it was, when they took the money. I said, my, the husband and I have been paying for it all along. I said, I've got, I don't have any receipts for it. I said, we were paying for it three days at a time. And then she asked me again about Robert coming to live with family. I said, I'm the only family he has that, that he can come live with. And I said, um, he can't live with us. I said, we have three children plus my father's here. And I said, in order for him to come here, we'd have to take all the doors out and get them all widened, plus a wheelchair ramp. I said, and with his illness, he can become belligerent, which the psychiatrist noted himself going in there and talking to him. And I said, it's very unpredictable behavior. I said, he's lived with me off and on through the years when he was having troubles. And he did. He lived with me in Eller's house. So anyway, and I said, a lot of his clothes has gone in the garbage. I said, he needs pants and a bag. I said, the husband and I bought him two pairs. I said, but he's very tall. He takes special kind of pants. You just can't buy them anywhere. I said, they, he they does? have to go to stores that sell longer lengths of pants. Yeah. And so she's going to try to get a clothes, clothing allowance for him. And I said, then he has a trustee in Halifax that has his Canada pension check. I said, but nobody can get it because Robert's supposed to go sign it. And I said, he can't go over there. So I said, basically, he has no money right now and hasn't had any money. I said, his bank card got stolen from his ex-girlfriend. And that's been gone since before he went into the hospital. I said, so if there's money in his account, nobody can touch it. And then um, she's going to find out about this brace. She said, what about the brace? I said, well, I guess social services is paying for it. I said, there's no way the husband and I is paying for anything else. No, I said, you're no, talking no. five and six hundred dollars. No. And I said, and I said, we got him a brand new pair of sneakers here. That the, the, if it's okay, the brace can go in. But I said, I thought he needed special shoes for the brace. She said, sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. So she has to find out. Yeah. But they don't want nothing at the hospital that come from his apartment. No. <coughs> nothing. Because they're afraid it could have bed bugs in it. That's understandable, I guess. In a way. It'd be terrible, you know, if there was something that probably had to be if that could have fallen off. Well, that's what she told me today. She, so, I don't know. Anyway, I just told her. I said, there's no way he can come here. I said, I worry about... I said, we have three children. 
I said yeah. one is under the age of two. It ain't only that. Zachary's I said, almost we're two. We're home all the time. He won't have 24 7 supervision. Well, plus the door we can stuff in the big. I told her all that. And we don't own the house to be able to make all these changes to. Told her that. I said, we just rent here. It's not our home. I said, and I have my father with me. I said, and, and I'm it. I said, he can go stay with Lisa for a day here and there. I said, but she's not mentally capable to look after him either. She can't look after herself. That's true. A lot. And I said, I don't have room where I live right now even to accommodate him. I said, I'd have to move and find a bigger place. You don't want to do that right and now. And I said, his kind of care and the psychiatric psychiatrists agree with me, is very specialized. I said, he even said he won't be able to go into a group home because he'll be belligerent and not do what he's told to do. And I said, and he's right, he will. I said, I know, I've seen it firsthand. I said, if he does it to me, and I can get him to Somebody calm took down the car. And do what I asked him to do, oh. I said, you imagine what he's going to do to a stranger who don't know him in a place of authority. I said, you just... Think about that concept. Yeah. I'm quite frank, surprised that he hasn't flipped out at the hospital yet. I I'm serious. Mm -hmm. Like, I can see it coming. Why? Sam's there. Sam's at anyway, the hospital. Uh, Wanted to tell you that. That's what you wanted to call me. Oh, oh, my, te oh, oh my teammates are alive? Team. That's good. I said, yeah, because we've been paying for it. I said, three days at a time, and it's expensive. Yeah. I said, and they move them around so often that you can't take, you you can't benefit from that. If you pay 270 you get so many days free. I said, because they move them around, and it doesn't apply once he's moved. I said, it only applies. If he stays in that room the whole time. And I said he's already been in three rooms. Yep. I said he gets canned a pension disability. I said, but he only gets $500 a month. He don't get very much. I said he was getting social assistance to, um, to oh, compensate for the difference, I said, but she told me he won't get that now that he don't have an apartment. So I said, I have no idea. I said, I haven't, I left her a message about his braces that he needed for his legs the day that the nurse called me and told me about it, and I haven't heard tell of her since. I said, she never called me back. And she hasn't. I honestly have no idea. But she said the only thing I could do about Robert's bank account is call him in my when bank I'm there in the room and get him to authorize him to talk to me. That's all that I, I only way we can try to do it. And that's what I said yesterday, so. Yeah. Because it's she said that on the phone, she said, oh, well, maybe I can see if Robert could call the bank. I said, Robert doesn't have the ability to do that. I said, Robert's mental capacity doesn't allow him to know the basics. I said, there's no way he'd be able to talk to somebody. He can't even say a full sentence most of the time. You don't just know and know anything? Or... It's like they don't talk to each other. I said, well, if you talk to a psychiatrist, you would know that he's not even going to go in a group home because of his belligerent behavior. I said, he told me that right up front. I said, he spent 15 minutes in the room with Robert and come out and told me that. So clearly, he said he'll be in a very specialized facility. That's what he said. And he's told me he will never live on his own again. He said, he is not capable. I said, well, I've been telling going? people that for years. Where are you going? Do you know how many apartments I've cleaned out of his from bed bugs and God knows what else since he's been on his own? I've lost track. And when he first was getting kicked out of places, guess who was paying his damage deposit? Because they don't pay it at social services on basic social Whoa, assistance. Whoa, ho, ho, you need to learn how to drive. They don't pay your damage deposit. 
And guess who had to uh, have, rent the truck when she never had one? And get rid of all this crap that he had bed bugs full of. And you know I didn't have no help. That goes without saying. Woohoo! I said, I tried having Robert live with me on in several times in the past. I said, and the last time wasn't that long ago. It was after Mom died. And I said, he was so belligerent, I had to take him back to the city because I didn't know what he was going to do next. I said, he was starting to get violent when I wasn't. I was at work. He was fighting with his sister, fighting with this one. Anyone that was around, he'd fight with. Just so he annoy everybody so he could get what he wanted, like a defiant kid. That's what he used to do. I said, Robert needs specialized care. Living with anybody is not an option. I said, if he had... Get out, get out, get out. Help me, help me, help me. Get out, get out. Hospital, he would get up oh, you're leave. stupid. This dude. And he would. Woohoo! I can tell you right now he would. If he didn't have that sitter in that room and those nurses coming and going like they do all the time because he needs the care right now, he would get up and leave. Just the way he was. And he'd rip all them cords out of his leg, arms, you name it, and wouldn't bend an eyelash. Oh, what? Going on oh, revive, revive, revive. To revive, revive. Tell me that. I said, that's why I fought to have a psychiatrist. She said, yes, you were a good advocate for your brother. That's what she said. And I said, and that's why I fought to have a sitter there 24-7. I said, because I know what he's like. I've lived with it my entire life. I was like, what do you think? He was 23, 24 when he had the nervous breakdown. He's seven years older than I am. Yep. Yeah. You want to get me a sandwich? Can I have a sandwich? No. No, you know we got you enough of them. There's Chinese food out there, plus there's, uh, um, all kinds of pizza bundles that we just bought last night again. Pizza bundles? Or whatever those things are. Pizza bites? I don't know. They were 97 cents, so we bought them. Oh my god, he just died. Ten of them. I ten just all about the same just missed thing, them. Whatever it was. Oh, level two. Level two buddy error. Oh, I got level three number. I don't know why he cried the whole time I was on the phone. Oh god. Dawson couldn't even get an answer out of him. Just sitting there crying. Just sit there crying the whole time. I was trying to be like, watch Peppa Pig. Nope. Cry. Do something. Nope. Just. Nope. Oh, thanks, Mom. I got ten dollars now. Thank you. I got. I got. I got. I got money. I lost. Oh God. Oh God. So his TV's not included in his room, that means I owe a bill there. Because he's been getting TV. Somebody's been ordering it for him. I haven't been. I thought it was free because it was a private room. I didn't know. I had no idea. I honestly did. I told that to Dad yesterday. Ask him. Okay. I said, 
Dad said, I wonder how he's getting TV. I said, it must be because it's a private room. <coughs> but that's not the case, so. There's going to be a bill there that I'll owe. Daddy, break back. He's going to get Mom a sandwich. You can't come, little man. What's wrong? Hmm? What is it? Him. Him. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Daddy's coming right back. Dad, right back. You be a good boy. And stay with Mommy. Daddy won't be long. Just going down the road for a sandwich. Oh, oh okay. Just a sec, buddy. You gotta wait a sec, okay? Mommy is not as strong as Daddy. Of course you weren't. <laughs> I'm fucking sorry. You find me? Sissy. Sissy's money. Can my money? No. Sissy's money. Mine? There you go. Mine? Got him. Sissy's money. Okay. 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 Yeah, you're a good boy. What are you talking about? He's just like, no. I'm, he's just like, I'm not a good... You are a good boy. What are you talking about? Yeah, that's brother. Don't take brother. Why don't you go down and knock on sissy's door and give her her money? Yeah! <gasps> that's a good idea. Take all this. Give it to sissy. I'm driving in the car, 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 driving in the car. Here. Dad in the car, Dad in the car. Oh god. Dad in the car, Dad. Oh god. No! Okay, yeah, I'm dead. Try. Brum, brum, brum. Hi, say hi, sissy. I'm here to give you your money. <laughs> no! What's happening? No. Oh God. Drive up the hill. <laughs> oh. Hey, don't hit brother. I'm gonna beat you up, boy. Stop hitting me! <sighs> beat you up. Stop hitting me! Get off me! Get off me! <laughs> Get off me, boy. Oh god. Oh 
Mom, mom, mommy, 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 mommy. I love you, mommy. How you doing, mommy? You need help? Oh, what the freak? Great. Oh, I need that rifle ammo. I need this rifle ammo. Drop this and drop. Pick up. Pick up. No. No. Oh, what? Pick up. There you go. You pick this up. Lots of ammo, and I'm not joking. I swear to God, if somebody opens this door, I'm ready to blast them up. Like, literally, I'm ready to blast them. Zachary! Ow! Stop! Do it again, you're going to- Ow! What's he hitting you with? Friggin' exercise crap. Oh my god! Move to the side- No! No! Mm. Holy frig, I didn't see that dude up on the hill. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Oh, butt boy. Yeah. 